Storehub.io offers Takelot Marketplace integration, an integration with your other online sales platforms like WooCommerce or Shopify, to ensure your stock and price remains accurate across all your online sales platforms. The Takelot.com integration takes approximately 15 minutes to complete, and thereafter you'll have price and stock updating and orders raising back from Takelot into your accounting system. No manual data entry required. So how does the integration work? Storehub.io syncs up all your product data from your accounting system to the Storehub platform and then pushes product stock on hand and price to the takelot.com marketplace. So we install the sync module, that goes to Storehub and then we can add on the takelot.com marketplace connector like so. So stock and price push and orders are written back to your accounting system. When an order is placed on Takelot, Storehub will write the order back as a sales order, invoice or quote to your accounting system. This means your stock is always correct, even if you receive many orders over the weekend or a public holiday. The sales document adjusts the stock on your accounting, Storehub picks up the stock change and automatically adjusts the stock on Takelot. Let's take a brief look at how easy it is to set up the Takelot sales channel on Storehub. Click on Channels. Add a channel, select take lots, and now we can populate the data over here to get the sync running. Give your take lot channel a name, select which warehouse you want to use to fetch your stock from, select which warehouse to pull price sheets from, and select which warehouse to write back your orders. We can also define a specific retail price list to send to take lot. This price list may be different from your other retail price list you sell on WooCommerce or to the general public. Select this price list over here. We can then also define a cash sale account to write all Takelot orders back to so it's easy to pull reports in the accounting system. If you have more than one Takelot profile, you can adjust the order prefix over here. The prefix is used on the sales documents in your accounting system. We can adjust the stock threshold, so essentially that will reserve stock for use elsewhere outside of the Takelot ecosystem. Over here, we can define what sales document we'd like the order to raise as from Takelot. A quote, sales order or an invoice. Over here, we'll paste the Takelot API key, which you get from your Takelot seller profile dashboard. If our Takelot profile is set to lead time only or stock at distribution center only, we can predefine the selection over here. Otherwise, on the product tab, you can define each product as if it's a lead time or a distribution center warehouse item. That would be termed a hybrid model. We can also set a generic lead time over here and decide if we want our items to show as in stock in Cape Town and Johannesburg or both. Once you're completed, simply click Submit. Storehub will then start updating price and stock automatically and fetching orders back from Takelot Marketplace. So why is integration with Takelot so important? It's critically important to ensure your stock levels are correct on your Takelot Marketplace listing. Incorrect stock and being unable to fulfill an order means your account can be blacklisted. You're also able to free up staff resources to focus on growing your business and eliminate the possibility of data capture errors with integration. So how much does this integration cost? The Storehub.io integration is priced by product SKU bands. So for example, 0 to 500 SKU codes or 501 to 2000 SKU codes. Please visit the Storehub pricing page over here. Select your accounting bracket and product SKU band and then select your sales channel with the relevant SKU bands over here. If you have any questions regarding the Takelot sales channel connector, please contact us at sales at storehub.io or contact us via telephone on our website. And we look forward to assisting you.